Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Tisa and we are here right now to do our Let's Collapse the View message. There's nothing to do here but to hear my voice as I bring you the spiritual message, okay? If you like our reading with me, everything is going to be raised down below in the description box. Let's go ahead and jump into this energy. Happy birthday to the sign of Aries. I really do hope that you enjoy your birthday season. So, in this message here, what I see here is a lot of secrets. Some secrets is about to come out. They're about to get revealed. All right, I don't even know where to begin, but I guess I'll go over here with a secret crush. A new love that's here could be a secret person. I feel like there's such a magnetic attraction with you and somebody or them and somebody, which I take it whatever way it resonates, right? But there's like this new, this new love energy that's here, and it's like such a magnetic attraction with this person. I feel like there's a secret, though. Either the new love have a secret, you have a secret, or the secret is that somebody's abusive, or somebody's in a toxic relationship, or somebody's codependency. I'm also feeling like the secret could be they don't have any money, or something like that, okay? All right, you know, and then for some of you, the secret could be somebody got a whole lot of money. So it's like whatever way it falls for you, but... I feel more so somebody over here don't have any money. Maybe somebody else do have a lot of money here. Okay, and somebody else I'm getting right here, they really don't have any money or they like really codependent. Okay. I'm getting like, that's a secret. Somebody doesn't know they don't have any money. Or that's the secret. Somebody has a secret crush over here. That's the problem with their money or something like that here. Right, Eva could be all right in the past, right? Somebody here didn't want to be married just to find out now they do want to get married. Something like that could be the case here, too. I feel like somebody wants to be realistic now. They want to roll something out right here with you. They want to get married to you. Because I feel like for some of you, maybe you did catch them before for secret love or something. I don't know. But I feel like they could have had a secret love before. I feel like this person want to roll something out with you now. They want to marry you, I feel, right here. Okay. Or this is somebody you was married to in the past. They didn't want to marriage. Now they do. I'm getting one here. Okay. I'm saying somebody is hella toxic for real. They like real toxic. Like you're not going anywhere or something like that. Like I feel like they might get triggered. Okay, maybe they're going to get triggered because you have a secret love. Or maybe you trigger this new love and you realize they're toxic as hell. Somebody is toxic. I'm getting right here for real. Okay. It's like this person don't want you to see them as false or they don't want to be in despair about you or something like that. It's like they don't. I feel like if you ghost to them, they're like, where are you? I'm getting like, for real, somebody can get obsessed quick. Somebody may show some toxic side of them quick, I feel right here. I feel, yeah. All right. I feel like because they was playing mind games before or something, it's like now they really need your trust or now they really want your love. And I'm just feeling like a toxic side of them may show up right here, I feel, okay. This reading um, right here is from, you know, March the 31st to April the 3rd, 2024, right? All right, so it's like all of a sudden somebody realized they can't do that toxic mess with you or you're not with that, I feel. I feel like you're not with all the toxic stuff or something like that. And they want to come out of the conflict right here with you, I feel. You know, because somebody here could be a millionaire, I feel, for some people here. Somebody's a millionaire, somebody else over here is toxic, and maybe they don't have any money or something, and I feel like somebody else on the other side may be a millionaire here. Okay. And the thing could have been right here, maybe somebody thought they could be toxic in some way, just to realize you're not with none of that. That's a tower. Okay, or when somebody try to come back and reconcile with you, they may realize right here, something's not a joke. You don't play those type of games or something like that. You don't play all those toxic games or somebody being a thief or whatever. Like somebody thinking they could come back and something be the same or like you accept something here or you would recognize them or something like that. I feel like 
something here that somebody be doing, you know, it'd be too much for somebody here. I feel like, you know, that could be hell to pay for that, I feel, in some way. Like, or, you don't, you're not going to deal with that, I feel. I feel like you're going to make your point heard loud and clear to somebody right here that, you know, you that's not something you get down with. You know, if somebody shows you a red flag in the beginning in some type of way, you better see it for somebody here. I'm telling you that right now. You better see it because I feel like the universe is giving you signs and signals and hints about something right here, about a new love, a secret crush, how they could be toxic as hell I'm getting right here. They could be toxic. If it's not a new love, it's somebody here that's trying to come back and reconcile. Maybe they realize you knew they had another love or a secret crush. They're toxic. Okay, I'm also could get that right here. It could be an ex that's toxic or this new love here that's showing up is toxic. Okay. I feel like something about whatever's going on right now is going to show you if the new love is toxic, if there is an ex-love here that's trying to come back, they could be toxic. Okay, but I feel like you're going to know that from the universe because they're going to send you some type of signal or hints right now, I feel. Mm-mm-mm-mm. I just feel like it's already a tower. I feel like somebody already know they was playing games, I feel, with somebody, right? So I just feel like the toxic energy might show up now because you already know that, I feel. If like you're, they already show what it was, like, you, you know? They could think like, all right, well, you know, they still love me. They're definitely going to take me back or something like that. I feel like something they're doing right here is a little bit too toxic. You already know that. You already know they're showing that type of energy, right? So that's a tower. They were thinking they could come back again in the future, I feel. And for some people here, there's not a chance. I'm getting like, not a chance, okay? Somebody could show you who they are once. That's enough for you. I'm getting like, that's enough right here for the Empress, right? A Taurus, a Libra right here. Um, a Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, an Aries. And I got, like I said, Taurus, okay? That's what I have right here. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like right here, like, somebody show who they are once to that person right there. You know, that's enough for them. It's a tower, I feel. Something here could be a challenge and a block and everything like that, right? So, yeah, I feel like, you know, somebody wish right here they didn't never, you know, show you some toxic side of them. Or they wish they never showed you they was playing mind games because if you're not trying to come back, they're going to be toxic or something like that. Now you're going to see some different side of them or something like that. But anyway, yeah, that's what I'm getting right here, okay? The next, um, you know, 48 to 72 hours or something like that, that's what I'm getting. So anyway, yeah, I'm going to end it right there. I think, thank you guys so much for taking a look and see this message. Don't forget if you like this video. Go ahead, give it a big fat thumbs up, subscribe, and even share it. Namaste to you.